Okay, this is disappointing. Tearmaker posts the 200 best albums of the last 25 years, album selected by Pitchfork, and then we have the albums ranked uh, by Twitter users. The top rankings are so obvious and boring. This is what happens when you basically like come to a consensus between what everybody thinks. The top albums are mostly Radiohead. And you don't get a woman on the list until you go down to the great stuff section. And then the first one is Bjork. And then uh, not too long after that, it's Lord and then Lana. But here's the worst part. Like we have a not my thing section in which there are some fantastic records. We have Stroke's Room on Fire, Meanwhile, Is This It? is in like the great stuff section. Two FKA Twigs records, uh, Fiona Apple's Pawn, also Flying Lotus's Cosmogramma, and that's, that's just like, you know, just the tip of the iceberg here. What's even worse is like moving further down, we have a how did this make the list section? I don't know, it, it, it made the list because it's great. Uh, freaking MIA's Kala, uh, the 69 Love Songs, uh, Soft Machine, Portishead's Third, super influential albums most people love. Don't even get me started on the haven't heard it yet part right at the very bottom. This is trash.